Yeah, so just a quick update on my Xerox trade. So uh, yesterday the market opened, uh, let's see, get a closer, do one hour chart here. Uh, yesterday the market opened way up here, 20, 20, or sorry, no, that's not right. <laughs> it opened at 20 uh, and then uh, went up and then came back down. And um, when it hit this retracement right here to cover the gap from the day before, that's when I put on my put uh, position. What I ended up doing was um, I sold, I should edit this, I should say one, just one July put at 17 um, and I got 72 cents for it. So it is um, the second week, I guess, in June and uh, we're gonna have to go through all through June and then three weeks into um, three weeks into July in order for that to expire. So that's going to be about six weeks uh, from now. So um, I got 72 cents for it. And if we do the math on that, so I had to put up $17 worth of margin, uh, you know, per, uh, per issue. So it's, you know, a 4.2% yield uh, for, if I wait through expiration, uh, you know, for six, seven weeks of waiting, something like that. And so I was talking about this on the, on the Leo Finance Discord, where, um, you know, I, I basically have plan A, B, and C uh, with this. So plan A is uh, if the stock price remains high and, uh, you know, options volatility decreases, price of the put goes down, uh, I have an order in that's good till cancel of 20 cents. So if I buy it back uh, within the next couple of weeks for 20 cents, then I got my, you know, after commissions, 50 cents even, and I'm happy. I move on to the next trade. Uh, plan B, if that doesn't work out, uh, I'm going to hold to expiration and the put expires worthless and I keep the full 72 cents. Plan C is the, uh, the put expires in the money and I have the uh, I have the stock at seventeen dollars, and then I'm sitting on a stock that's generating a one dollar dividend, um, which is a uh, at, you know, and I got it for uh, seventeen bucks. Well, but really, I didn't get it for seventeen. I got it for sixteen twenty-two. So one divided by sixteen twenty-two. So then I'm at a six percent dividend, which again, six percent is kind of a magic number. And then, you know, I'll proceed to sell covered calls against it. So, uh, yeah, plan A, B, and C for this particular trade uh, as far as an exit goes. And, um, <coughs> and yeah, so that's, that's the update. Everything's working out great so far. And, you know, when this trade closes, I'll record another video and uh, let you guys know.